Newcastle have already made their first move with Kieran Trippier, but who should they sign next? I'll be analysing five players who would improve Newcastle in their relegation battle. Let's begin with someone I've always been a fan of, that is Moussa Dembele. He is Leon's striker, who hasn't exactly had the best time since the 19-20 season, but the 25-year-old definitely has quality. In back-to-back -back seasons, he scored 15, then 16. Since then, he's not had great form at Leon. he also had a loan at Atletico Madrid last season, then has returned to Leon, and in an injury hit season, he's been able to score 4 goals so far in 11 matches. After now just returning from injury though, I think now would be the right time to move on from Leon. they seem open to selling the striker, and he can go elsewhere to settle into a team and become a first team regular striker. Dembele's finishing ability is fantastic, in the 2019-20 season he had a conversion rate of 29% which is a really impressive number. I'd love to see him in the Premier League and at 25 years of age he does have all the qualities to be a regular striker in the Premier League. It's not a signing that'd cost too much for Newcastle, and Leon are reported to be willing to sell in January, so let's see what happens here. Next is an obvious one in Sven Botman from Lille, so let's keep this one fairly short. Negotiations around this transfer are sounding tough right now, he's a player who has been targeted by many clubs, and that was after his title winning 20-21 season in the French League. That season really was a standout one for him, and it's clear to see why he's been a player in high demand. He won the 7th most aerial duels that season with 121 and had a great win rate of 69%. 382 ball recovery was the third most in the league, so his anticipation and reading of the game, keeping things neat at the back, really showed that season. He is a left-footed centre-back, so it's another reason why there is a lot of interest in him. At 21 years of age, about to turn 22, Newcastle will be signing a great player, and someone to be in their backline for many seasons. Next up is Romain Fivre, and there have been reports in the past about Newcastle being interested in him, although not too many, and more of a recommendation of mine. It does seem that AC Milan is a likely destination at the moment however. Newcastle though could look to fight for him in January as a move could happen this month and they'd be adding creativity and flair into their team with him. Defensively he's solid too, last season he won 54 tackles and made 30 interceptions. He's left footed and has played left midfield last season, this season though he's playing right midfield so of course this shows versatility. Fiverr has scored 8 and assisted 6 this season in all competitions, he creates chances and always looks to take Take on the opposition when he's on the ball, he's a specialist when it comes to dribbling. He would definitely add some unpredictability to the Newcastle team and would be a welcome figure in Newcastle's midfield. On to a defensive midfielder now that has recently been linked to many Premier League clubs and that is Bruno Guimaraes. The 24 year old is another that plays for Leon, and a move for him seems quite likely, possibly not in January but I do wonder if Newcastle were to have a go if they'd be able to tempt them to sell. He would be a fantastic addition into their midfield. This season, he's played the most passes into the final third with 128 and the most progressive passes too with 118. It's fair to say that he's forward thinking when he's on the ball and his passing range is exactly what can make a difference to a side like Newcastle. A good tackler of the ball too, he'd be someone to completely change Newcastle's midfield and upgrade it by himself. It'd be a big signing and a tough one to complete with the competition and interest in the player, but if Newcastle really did want to sign him, I'm sure they'd do everything they could to get him. At left back, Nicolas Tagliafico looks like a great opportunity in the market, available cheap and would make a difference in the team. He's 29 so he's got a lot of experience, he's played at the highest level with Ajax and he would add some discipline into the starting 11. He'd be the signing of a fullback who's really strong in defence, last season he was averaging 2 tackles and 2 interceptions per 90 minutes. And of course, coming from Ajax, all of their players need to be good technically with their on the ball qualities. And with the way that Eddie Howe wants his Newcastle team to play, it'd really be great to have a player like Tagliafico in the team. Tagliafico has played in a system that Eddie Howe would love to implement at Newcastle, so this transfer really does make a lot of sense, let's see if Newcastle do get a deal done for him. Who else should they sign? Let me know in the comments below. If you did enjoy this video then please click the like button, it really does help the videos getting found more than you can imagine. And for more insight and analysis, subscribe to Route 1.